Hello, this is Father Ken Lau and welcome to the new episode of Nuggets for the Soul. Uh, last August 8, 2021 is the closing ceremony of the 2020 Olympics that was held in Tokyo, Japan. And in this episode, I would just like to feature to you uh, some Olympic athletes or teams uh, who, were, who, who would really profess their Christian faith. Okay? And uh, one of those is uh, Hidalin Diaz. Uh, from the Philippines, and I'm from the Philippines, that's why I'm so proud that she won the first gold medal for the Philippines. Uh, the, the Philippines has been participating in the Olympics for 97 years, and this is her first gold medal. You know, uh, Hidalin Diaz uh, is a sign of perseverance. Uh, this is her fourth Olympics in 2008. She was second to the last uh, in, in, in weightlifting, okay? And in 2012, in the second Olympics that she participated, she was 12 among the 19th athletes who competed. And in 2016, she won the silver. And in this year, she won the gold. And uh, so when she was being awarded the, the, the gold medal in the, uh, on the podium there, uh, she was not really uh, showing off the Olympic gold medal, but Our Lady's Miraculous Medal that she also had around her neck okay and uh, she told this to a uh, to reporter I did not expect to lift it yesterday uh, I guess that was God and all the people who prayed for me yesterday I'm thankful to those who prayed and did the novena so what happened there was uh, I think she was saying that it was kind of miraculous really that uh, she had not only beaten her personal record by managing to raise and sustain a huge 279.9 pounds above her head. She'd also uh, beaten the world record in her 55 kilogram weightlifting category. Okay? And she said that um, a friend of hers gave her uh, this miraculous medal uh, and both she and her friend uh, prayed a novena. Uh, and uh, she said he had a novena for nine days then I also had a novena. It was a sign of prayers with faith in Mama Mary and Jesus Christ. So if you want to know more about the Miraculous Medal, uh, I've made a YouTube video out of it. And uh, the original name of the Miraculous Medal is the Our Lady of Grace Medal. But because of so many mirac miracles that was at, uh, attributed to it, it was called Miraculous Medal. Okay? And the second athlete that I would like to feature to you is a swimmer from South Africa. And her name is Tatiana Skenmaker. Okay, so she won the gold in the 200 meter breaststroke. And uh, she swam uh, with a pair of cross shaped earrings. And underneath her official team, South Africa issued swim cap. Uh, Skenmaker donned a white swim cap with the words Soli Deo Gloria. So, glory, which means glory to God alone. So before uh, going to the Summer Olympics, uh, she wrote on, uh, on her Instagram page and Twitter, uh, she, she said, Father God, may your will be done. May your peace fill us up. May we praise you no matter what the outcome. May we be empowered by your strength to give it our all. And may we forever be in the awe of your goodness. So you, we could see here how Tatiana Skenmaker uh, was using her, her social media platform uh, to discuss her Christian faith. So in the next episode, I will also feature uh, other Olympic athletes or teams who would really profess their faith. Be a living saint. Jesus, Mary, Joseph, we trust in you.